guys, you're about to see a test with a Manticore Deus II in the Legend. Um, the test is the gold coin that I've used in previous videos. If this is your first time to my channel, I have videos of when the Manticore first come out compared to the Deus II and compared to the Legend. So if you go back and you look through my channel, you will find some older videos of this same test. And I thought this would be a good place. I've got to work today, so I couldn't actually go out in the field, but I thought this would be a good place to check the stabilizer and check the update and see if it has affected the unmasking capabilities on the nail test. Now, I've got to take it to the Colonial site because if you will remember, the manacle when it first come out passed the nail test pretty much with flying colors and it wasn't until I actually got it in the field on the colonial sites that I found the problem and many others found the problem too with the nail falses. Now the update addresses that, so we'll be looking at the stabilizer in the next week or so. We're gonna be looking at the stabilizer real heavy and comparing it to the other machines because we know how it was behaving prior to the update, so we'll see how it behaves after the update. You guys be the judge. You look at what I got set up here, and I'll tell you. The question is gonna be, is the stabilizer setting, how does it affect uh, you know, the unmasking capabilities and what are the negative downfalls of it? And that's gonna be what we're gonna to attempt to answer. And if you have to use a stabilizer, where does the Manticore stack up in the leading detectors in hunting iron in 2023? So. Stay tuned for all that's coming up. Here's the nail test. See you guys maybe tomorrow or the next day uh, going diving early on this week. So I will be testing this machine. I know everybody wants to know and I want to know myself. I have a curious mind. Thanks for watching. All right, guys. So we've got the Manticore out here today. We got the legend in the day is two. We've got the update. We got the Calabash Digger famous coin nail test. Now, I have videos up of the Manticore Prior to the update, you guys know that I got one early on and tested it. Great machine, found a, a killer Revolutionary War button with it uh, on a saltwater beach. It ran really good on a saltwater beach. The screen is great. The only gripe that I had with the machine was the iron handling capabilities and the falsing issue, but this update has targeted the falsing issues. But we're gonna look at something here, and I don't know what to make of this. I'm gonna show you the settings on the Manticore, and like I said, I've got older videos, if you go back and look at my channel, with this same exact test. So we're gonna check it out, and you guys tell me what you think, and we'll take suggestions, but I'm gonna cut the dais on, and I'm gonna put the microphone on the dais, and I'm gonna cut the legend on. The dais is gonna be cut on in fast factory settings. I'm not gonna change anything. The legend, all these detectors are running, I'm running depth audio on the Manticore, pitch on the Legend, and uh, pitch on the Deus II because that's what I relic hunt with and I just want an alert of tone. And I'll show you the setup here uh, on this and all's got 11 inch coils on the Deus and the Manticore and we've got that um, LG, I can't remember the number on it, new coil that Nocta released on the, on the Legend. <coughs> but I don't know what to make of this. So go back, look at the previous videos I've had. Uh, the upper ferrous limits are nine and three and nine. I'm not gonna mess with that because nine in the previous update, I couldn't actually hunt uh, this colonial side up here. So we're gonna use the update, test that, but we're gonna leave the upper ferrous limits at nine and three stock. Same with the day is two and the fast and the legend the same. We're gonna uh, pretty much leave it stock. So. Recovery speed is, I believe it's three in the FAST program. I think the recovery speed is five or six on the Manticore, we'll look at that. And the Legend, uh, we'll look at, I think it's five on it. But let us let me show you the test without further ado. Let me, let me get the camera here situated uh, where you guys can see this real good. Make sure that we're getting the audio on the GoPro. It looks like we are, so that's a good thing. Um, but you guys see the, See the nail test down there? We'll look at the settings on the Manticore too. Now, you guys know that the day is two does not save the settings, so as soon as I cut it on, it goes back into the factory fast program. So let me get it cut on and show you guys right here. So basically, we're just gonna kick it on. Let's see here. There we go, that's the fast program. Now, I'm gonna hook the mic on the machine real quick. I ain't even ground can uh, noise canceled it or nothing. I, if I have to, I will if we got some interference. Um, 
So here, here's here's the gold coin. And I'm going to keep the same coil height on all detectors pretty close. Just get a bunch of speed on it and it goes away. Hard signals, uh, small, mid to low conductor in iron there, guys. So let me cut that off. I'm trying to do this with one mic because my other mic is dead, so you guys bear with me on the audio. We're gonna cut the legend on. We're gonna put the camera, we're gonna put the camera on the manicure so you guys can see the settings. Uh, we get the legend cut on. Let me hook this little magnet back on here before I lose it. All right, so we're gonna get the legend fired up. Okay, we got the legend fired up. See, we're in M2, to what program we're in, park. Let's see if we can get the legend to hit it. I might have a little EMI because it was actually So we can get the legend to blip on it. <coughs> so we can get the legend to blip on it, okay? That's without doing any tweaking, really. So let's get the manicure out. Give me just a second. And I'm gonna take the camera and actually put it on the manicure after I show you guys this, and I'm gonna show you guys the settings. So give me just a minute. Hope the audio's okay. I'm moving that mic around, handling it. I might can show you the settings here. Let's see. Let me see what the camera's doing. So this is the manicure. I got the sensitivity on 20. A little noise cancel it. Long noise cancel it. We're going to let it ride right there. You see the screen on it. I've got it uh, all metal. All terrain general. And then we'll try it all terrain general. Uh, then we'll go to low conductor. Actually, we'll go back to recover speed six, discrimination pattern. We want to go over here to all metal and kick up preset nine and four, ferrous volume. There is no stabilizer cut on, everything is off. So that's what you got. Uh, let's see what happens here with the manicure. Look at it one more time in recovery speed. Let's look at the recovery speed. Recovery speed is six. Let's go back in here and we'll go down to low conductor, which I tested in previous version. Low to all terrain low conductor. Ground balance, recovery speed six. Scrimmage space pattern all metal, nine and three. Stabilizer will be off. Uh, Let's see here, depth, audio, theme, and that's kind of to match and make a mimic uh, all the way across the board. So watch this. You guys see that right there? I'm going to so then, this brings us to a very interesting question. That previous testing to the Manicore, a nine and a three was a uh, was was stretching it for what I had to run it. Now we could lower the upper ferrous on the Manicore and see what happens with that. But let's just introduce some stabilizer just for kicks and uh, see what happens with that. So 
Give me just a minute. I'm gonna uh, put some stabilizer in the machine and we'll see what happens. And I'll point you guys back down so you guys can see. Let me see if I can kind of get me in the frame and the target in the frame a little bit. Maybe that did it. Let me look on the back. Yeah, that's kind of kind of good. So I'm going to add stabilizer here. We're just going to cut the... Um, ooh, I guess we'll just cut the... Just cut it on one. Wiggle, slow. Stabilizer two. Start to deteriorate on the wiggle. Okay, I got a thunderstorm coming. Stabilizer three. Four. Five. Five. Okay, let's cut the stabilizer filter on. That's stabilizer five. Okay, let's cut the filter off. Well, let's just leave the filter on. Stabilizer four. What? On. Stabilizer four. All right, we're going to continue this test at a later time because I got a bad storm coming, so you guys can see the see the sky. So stay tuned for part two.